Andrew Lloyd Webber said his home once housed a poltergeist. In an interview with The Telegraph published on Tuesday, the iconic composer, 75, said that he examined paranormal activity in his home in Belgravia, a district in central London, until he called on the help of a priest. I did have a house in Eaton Square which had a poltergeist, he said when asked if any of his theatres are haunted. It would do things like take theater scripts and put them in a neat pile in some obscure room. In the end, we had to get a priest to come and bless it, and it left. The term poltergeist is German for noisy ghost and is a spirit blamed for unexplained physical noises. While Weber didn't specify when the poltergeist appeared in his home, the revelation comes after a busy time for the impresario, whose Phantom of the Opera musical took its final bow in April 2023 after 35 years on Broadway. The musical made its Broadway debut in 1988 after opening on the West End in 1986 and is known as the longest-running show in Broadway history. Weber arranged a trio version of the song, Think of Me, for the final show and dedicated the performance to his late son, Nicholas Lloyd Weber. Nicholas died from gastric cancer at 23 on March 25, 2023, days after Weber announced that he had to be hospitalized due to being critically ill. I am shattered to have to announce that my beloved elder son Nick died a few hours ago in Basingstoke Hospital. His whole family is gathered together and we are all totally bereft. Thank you for all your thoughts during this difficult time, Weber said in a statement shared with People.